the so-called artificial intelligence presents a rather confusing challenge. As many of us observe, it feels as though humankind is helplessly trapped in the act of creating a great godlike superhuman, one that will ultimately outdo its human creator in every way and might also enslave us all. However, this superhuman machine narrative is just that, a narrative, and at its core, this narrative assumes that we have no choice but to personify this machine and endow it with human-like attributes. By viewing AI in this way, it heightens the existential concern surrounding it. But as said, this is unnecessary, and there's at least one other way to think about this so-called artificial intelligence. To illustrate, let's say for example, that there is a machine that creates extraordinary classical music compositions. The music is engaging, lively, and extremely creative. Any classical music lover would have to agree that the caliber of this music was right up there with Mozart, Beethoven, Bach, etc. Well, normally, we'd impose the superhuman narrative upon this machine. We think of the machine as an independent, creative consciousness that's out there creating original works of music. But the other narrative that you can impose upon this music-making machine is what might be called the designer narrative. In the designer narrative, you don't personify the machine. Instead, you direct the focus to the people who created or designed the music-making machine. And it's these expert designers who are truly responsible for the originality of the music. While it's true that the machine is generating symphonies that no one of the designers directly wrote, the designers nevertheless completely intended that there be a machine that could make such fantastic music. The designer narrative would apply whether we're describing a narrow AI, which would specialize in a specific human task, as well as a general AI that can do virtually all human tasks. In all cases, the brilliance of the machine, even a machine that makes music, is the ultimate fulfillment of the human's intention. From a cultural vantage point, I believe it's not only imperative to our general well-being that we avoid terminology that might severely damn us down the road, I believe it's technically more accurate to use something like the designer narrative when discussing this variety of machine. Because really, what we now call artificial intelligence is a dynamic repository of the ingenious computer codes that have been designed into the machine by the countless teams of brilliant, creative computer coding people. To further the conversation, I propose that the term artificial intelligence be replaced by a new, more accurate phrase, and my suggestion for this term combines the words algorithmic and network to create the word algonet, or algonet machine. And crucially, instead of one saying, this music was written by AI, one would stretch out the observation and say, these designers have created an algonet machine that writes extraordinary music. Maybe quite the mouthful. But I think our current, more simple way of saying this is both damaging as well as insufficiently complex. A term like this would alleviate this extraordinary machine from its awkward intelligence connotation and instead offer a broader insight about how the machine's designers have brought this impressive network of tools into being. Thank you.